Mama Badger would probably shit little hit kittens if she knew what I was doing. Don't try this at all. Oh, God. Oh. What were you thinking? What's up, guys? Sonny the Badger here. And welcome to my Friday free ride. So every Friday, I take you on a ride with me, and we talk motorcycles. If you're a motorcycle lover like I am, and you like to talk motorcycles, look at motorcycles, ride motorcycles, then this is the channel for you. So be sure you hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Well, that's not good. So I keep uh, giving it gas, but I'm not moving forward. That is definitely an issue. Well, the other part is I am on a road that I have never been on. I have no idea what's up ahead of me, um, where to pull over. I'm getting out of the way because there's a car behind me. And then uh, I guess I'm just going to let this coast as far as I can and uh, see where I end up but uh, unfortunately yeah I don't know the road or anything I'm definitely not going anywhere fast so hopefully I can make it up to this little off-road shoot here well at least I'm out of the road um, or at least out of the main road and uh, I guess we'll figure this out Well, after messing with this for a little while, I mean, it's pretty evident that um, it's not going to go anywhere. Uh, so I just got to figure out what to do next. Um, I did notice that there's a gas station up here on the left. So I guess I'll just push it up there. Soon as the traffic clears anyway. Dun -da -da. Dun -da -da. All right, let's get this show on the road. And I don't want to push it from Side here. <laughs> here we go. Old damn man pushing 600 pound bike up the road to the gas station. You know it didn't look that far, but the more I push this bike, the further it feels like I'm going. <laughs> I'm way too old for this shit. I guess another interesting piece to this is the Phil's Light temp right now is about 110 degrees. So it is hot as Hades um, and I'm pushing this damn motorcycle. So to tell you that uh, it's getting the best of me uh, would be an understatement. If this isn't a testament to how old and out of shape I am, I don't know what is. <laughs> but I am done. Alright guys, so I'm continuing my Friday free ride, I guess. So, sitting here at this lovely little gas station, 
bike is broke. I was cruising down the road. You'll see in the video. Went to revving up the bike. Nothing. I have no drive. So I don't know if the clutch went out. I don't know yet. Haven't got it home to see what situation I'm in with that. But um, she's broke. So this is the second time ever that she's left me sitting alongside the road. Um, she does have almost 90,000 miles. So I mean, I guess I can't complain too much about it. Anyway, so here I sit, all broken hearted. Hi guys, so, a buddy of mine came to get me. He had a enclosed trailer. We didn't have much room and no way to tie the bike down. So I was like, fuck it, I'll ride in the back and hold the bike. So, I'm riding in the back, holding the bike. Here's the inside of the trailer. <laughs> There's the bike. There's me holding the bike. Woo! So anyway, I have no idea how this video is gonna turn out. I don't know if you guys can see me. I can see the light. It's fucking bright. Got some water back here. I will uh, finish the story as we move along. Woo! Hold it on, bitch! Whoa! Oh, turn on the corner! That's heavy when you're turning the corner. I guess, I don't know if you can see me or not. It's hot as balls in this little enclosed trailer. About five minutes from the house, pouring water on myself to try to stay cool. I'm trying to hold up 600 pound bike as we go around corners. Whatsoever. Just diesel fumes from the truck that's pulling me. But hey, why take two trips when you can do it in one, right? Holding the brake on. That arm's getting tired. Holding the bike up. Both legs are getting tired. Hot as fuck. But this will make for a hell of a video. Seems like five minutes is taking 14 hours. Badger would probably shit little hit kittens if she knew what I was doing. Don't try this at all. Oh god. Oh. Hold that motherfucker up. Yeah. Ride it like you stole it. Man, I cannot wait for some fucking air. kind of funny trying to guess where I'm at in the route home in a dark enclosed trailer on the back of a bike should I be making noises potato 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 oh, fuck. I 
Well, I don't think we're here yet, but we're stopped. Uh, how crap. I can't put the kickstand down. Um, I've got the foot pegs folded up. Um, literally, there's no room except for my legs to hold the bike up. My phone overheated. Of course it did. Woo! We're here. See if I can back this motherfucker out of here now without dying. Look at that. I can fucking blend it. Holy shit. Oh, right here for now. All right, guys, I'm back from my adventure. Fuck, it was hot in that enclosed trailer. So you can see the bike's back there. It's home. I'm home standing in front of the fan. Fortunately, it had water, so my shirt is soaked with water. Uh, it's just hot, and it was a diesel truck, so the fumes were a little bad. But, <laughs> but, but, I'm home alive and well. Wore the fuck out. But I got a story to tell. Stay tuned for the video. See ya. All right, guys. So while I was out today doing the Friday free ride with Silverbike there, she quit on me. And that's where things get interesting. Be sure you watch tomorrow's Friday free ride so I can tell you all about it. What a fucking adventure. <laughs>